Well, EA has released a new tweet with captions including films, movies and also popcorn and looking at the picture, it seems like some superhero kind of thing. So let's make a guess in today's video. Hello everyone, this is BMY and welcome back to my channel once again. Before I start this video, I would like to say that this is not an official EA post or neither am I sponsored by the website that I got this reference from. So before I start this video, this is something I want to clarify with you guys and just take whatever information here with a pinch of salt. So let's proceed on to the video which is What if football players were superheroes? Alright, let's start with our very first superhero which is Lewandowski as Cyclops. What binds Lewandowski to the superhero Cyclops from X-Men? Both are born with superhuman abilities. The Polish striker had already become famous when the days of Borussia Dortmund, along with Mario Gotze and also Marco Reis when Lewandowski was able to reach the historic Champions League final against Bayern Monica on 2013. But now he has become a flash player superhero when on September 22, he has scored 5 goals in 9 matches against Uzbek in Bundesliga. Cyclops is considering the most beloved superheroes mutant among the X-Men and the leader of his team. Similarly, Lewandowski's teammate respects the player and know how much power and force reserve the striker of Bayern Monaco. So we have Lewandowski right here with Cyclops. So guys, make a guess whether is it possible to have him as the next promo, masters or even the legends. Secondly, it's Eden Hazard as Green Lantern. Just like the Eden Hazard's crystalline ability to invent spectacular play, the Ring of the Green Lantern is the most powerful weapon in the galaxy. Gives the holder the ability to create any object can imagine. From the simplest to the most complex of any size consisting of a green energy. The consistency of the creation is directly proportional to the strength of the will of the bearer of the ring, while the duration may vary. During the season at Jose Moreno Chelsea, proving to be the best player in the Premier League, Hazard has shown to be one of the strongest and most promising playmaker in world football. But I guess he won't be the next master or even the legend because there's already a promo regarding him with the Blue Star Hazard. Next up, the website has linked Pogba as Wolverine. Pogba is one of the most promising talent of the football scene. This year has proven to Ken drag along his team Juventus to win the fourth title in a row in Serie A against all betting odds. Thanks to his strokes of genius and his later shots, just like Wolverine, he sharpens his blade in the most difficult moments and has the power to regenerate and heal the wounds in a very quick time. Take to this ability after a bad injury, managed to recover in time for the next Champions League finals against FC Barcelona. But this is a very old news because he's already in Manchester United. So, can he be the next legend or even the master? Make a guess. Next up, we have Iron Robin as Captain America. He has strength, speed, agility, flexibility, endurance of pain and fatigue, recovery time, balance, reflexes, and physical efficiency to levels that represent the peak of human possibilities. He has also shown that it has obtained a superhuman strength, grossing hits from characters with superhuman strength and equally enduring fallen from extreme heights. We are talking about Iron Robin, the fantastic Bayern Munich and Dutch national team Wingo, which has almost the same as Captain America. So what are your thoughts on this? Next up, we have Ribery as Beast in X-Men. As Ribery has made the obvious scars on his face that it remains mostly a mystery, similarly it is a mystery how Henry Philip McCoy became Beast, one of the five founders of the mutant group of X-Men. However, the appearance of Beast hides an intellect above any common mortal. And this is true even for Ribery speaking about football qualities. The French midfielder considered by many of the few active midfielders in the world has been able to win the 2013 UFL Best Player in Europe award, beating off competition from Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo. Next up, we have Aguero as Thor. Thor has been trained to fight since he was a child, just like the young Sergio Aguero who won two FIFA World Cup under 20 with Argentina. Also just like Thor, he has extensive experiences in fight. Aguero currently holds the scoring record in European competitions both with Atletico Madrid and Manchester City. His other skills like the tall hero is the incredible intelligence fail. In front of the goalkeeper, the citizen striker does not miss a goal, precise and fatal. 
Next up, we have Alexis Sanchez as the Daredevil, cynical and extremely smart. Sanchez is the alter ego of the very strong superhero Daredevil. Unbeatable in the martial arts, incredible sense of hearing even as the Garner striker position in the field, Sanchez beat his personal goals in the season record just this year with Arsenal in his first championship in the Premier League. Explosive strength, imagination, agility and practicality makes Sanchez the Daredevil of English, European and worldwide football. Next up, we have Diago Costa as Hawk. Diago Costa is undoubtedly the Hawk in international football. Although there's already a player called Hawk, but in terms of strength, power, endurance, Diago Costa is the player who most resembles the green beast. When he decides to point a goalkeeper, opponents cannot stop it, even clinging to his ankles. So much so that the defenders are careful not to oppose or to bother him. Next up, we have Wayne Rooney as the thing in the Fantastic Four. The Manchester United captain is a true force of nature. Rooney is very strong physically, able to shoot from a long distance and despite his poorly height, he managed to master the aerial game. By himself, he could drive an entire offensive unit. So this is a very embodiment of Ting, the massive superhero part of the Fantastic Four. Powerful, indestructible, but with a big heart, just like what Rooney has demonstrated towards the Red Devil supporters. Next up, we have Gareth Bale as Batman. Gareth Bale in his way of playing is definitely the Batman in the playing fields. Tenacious, relentless in his raids on the wing. Bale's acts in the shade and then come forward without fear in the decisive moments as in the last 2014 Champions League final, Real Madrid vs Atletico Madrid, getting rid with ease of the competitors. Sure to Real Madrid has to suffer the absence of a valid 8 as Robin and the presence of other superheroes equal to its level. Ronaldo for first but in his uh, uniqueness is the best ever power in the legs, running and cunning. Next up, we have Luis Suarez as the Martian Manhunter. Luis Suarez is the last extraterrestrial humanoid remain on Earth. Suarez as striker and scorer is really a Martian. Nowadays, there are very few players who can score like he does, which is why it's probably the last of his kind. When he sees the ball, he's transformed. There are no defenders that can contain Luis Suarez. Next up, we have Neymar as the Spider-Man. Neymar has a slim and light body, just the same as Spider-Man, and this is not a weakness but his strength. It is thanks to his body that Neymar managed to create surprising tricks with the ball at his feet. Exactly with the same ease as Spider-Man climbs the skyscrapers of New York, the Brazilian strikers enchants his opponent in an embarrassing way and then he lay them out giving the final blow also to the goalkeeper. Barcelona's forward seems a sparrow when splashing through the jersey players and when he places the final blow in the goal. Next up, we have Ibrahimovic as the Iron Man. There are few words to describe a complete player like Ibrahimovic. The Swedish player is exactly an Iron Man. Wherever he plays, he makes havoc. Through Ajax, Juventus, Inter Milan, Barcelona, AC Milan, PSG, Ibrahimovic is remembered by his opponents as much as his teammates. He has given us extraordinary goals, strokes of genius, and moments of entertainment and nervousness. And despite everything and everyone, always drag his team to success. Next up, we have Leo Messi as the Flash. It's really difficult to find the right superhero for Messi. The Argentine is one of the best players in football history, probably as strong as Maradona and Pelé. For this, he can be said to have more characters than just one. But if I were to find a superhero with his quality, surely that is the Flash. His speeds and rapidity in execution are not equal to any players never assisted. Passing, shooting, dribbling, nutmeg. No matter what Messi wants to do, he's certain that he could do it fast just like the Flash. Lastly, we have Cristiano Ronaldo as the Superman. The first superhero who comes to mind when talking about Ronaldo is certainly Superman, the superhero with powers and qualities most complete, strength, intelligence, cunning, perfect fitness. The Portuguese is a record man like Messi. He scores in any way, dribble, hit it and he has a strike on a free kick unstoppable. Perhaps Ronaldo missing a bit of modesty, but in some occasion even Superman has seen of arrogance against its opponents. However, both samples can always adjust the situation and get out winners. Alright guys, this is just an analysis from the website. So what are your thoughts on the upcoming promo and who do you think the Legends and Masters is going to be? Please leave your comments on the comments box down below and also try to smash 200 likes and subscribe if you're new. I will see you guys in the next one. To the very next video, leave you guys stay cool.